Don't fancy running with the crowd? Consider yourself something of a maverick? Don't like Android, iOS, or even Windows Phone? Then you might want to consider this. It's the Mizu Pro 5 Ubuntu Edition. So the headline feature of this phone is definitely that rather than Android or iOS, it's running Ubuntu. Now this uncommon operating system is at first actually quite frighteningly simple. So I'll give you a little bit tour of the interface in case you're not familiar. So it's all done with gestures. If you swipe down from the top, you get this uh, notifications panel. That'll be familiar to anyone who's used Android a little bit. If you swipe in from the right here, you get a multitasking view of all the different apps uh, that you've got running. If you swipe in from the left, that's where you get to your app launcher. So there's no home screen as such. This this is where you open apps from. If you press this home button on the bottom here, you'll get taken to the scopes screen. Now the idea of scopes is that it pulls in lots of information. Now that could be from uh, locations around you, it could be from other apps. So you've got things like uh, news and calendar alerts here. If you swipe through, you can see places nearby. You can see apps you might like to install or news stories. Uh, if you want to customize these scopes pages, um, then you just swipe up from the bottom of the screen here and you can arrange all the different pages there. Software aside, this is a pretty standard smartphone. So for instance, this is a 5.7 inch display. That's pretty big. It's got an octa-core processor on the inside. That's a 21.1 megapixel camera. And I have to say, I quite like the design. It's got this nice rounded back. It feels pretty good. So of course, not being one of the majorly popular operating systems, you would have to put up with fewer apps on this phone. But I have to say, I quite like the interface. It's very simple. If you're determined to have something different, it might be worth checking out.